Nonsense Alphabet by Edward Lear. Illustrated and read by Melanie Chadwick. A was an ant who hardly stood still and who made a nice house in the side of a hill. Nice little ant. B was a book with a binding of blue and pictures and stories for me and for you. Nice little book. C was a cat who ran after a rat, but his courage did fail when he seized on his tail. Crafty old cat. D was a duck with spots on his back who lived in the water and always said quack. Dear little duck. E was an elephant, stately and wise. He had tusks and a trunk and two queer little eyes. Oh, what funny small eyes. F was a fish who was caught in a net, but he got out again and is quite alive yet. Lively young fish. G was a goat who was spotted with brown. When he did not lie still, he walked up and down. Good little goat. H was a hat, which was all on one side. Its crown was too high and its brim was too wide. Oh, what a hat. I was some ice, so white and so nice but which nobody tasted, and so it was wasted. All that good ice. J was a jackdaw who hopped up and down in the principal street of a neighbouring town, all through the town. K was a kite which flew out of sight above houses so high, quite into the sky. Fly away, kite! L was a light which burned all the night and lighted the gloom of a very dark room. Useful nice light. M was a mill which stood on a hill and turned round and round with a loud hummy sound. Useful old mill. N was a net which was thrown in the sea to catch fish for dinner for you and for me. Nice little net. O was an orange, so yellow and round. When it fell off the tree, it fell down to the ground. Down to the ground. P was a pig, who was not very big. But his tail was too curly and that made him surly. Cross little pig. Q was a quail with a very short tail and he fed upon corn in the evening and morn. Quaint little quail. R was a rabbit who had a bad habit of eating the flowers in gardens and bowers. Naughty fat rabbit. S was the sugar tongs. Sippity see to take up the sugar to put in our tea. Sippity see. T was a tortoise, all yellow and black. He walked slowly away and he never came back. Torty never came back. U was an urn, all polished and bright and full of hot water at noon and at night. Useful old urn. V was a villa which stood on a hill by the side of a river and close to a mill. Nice little villa. W was a whale with a very long tail whose movements were frantic across the Atlantic. Monstrous old whale. X was King Xerxes who more than all Turks is renowned for his passion of fury and passion. Angry old Xerxes. Y was a U which flourished and grew by a quiet abode near the side of a road. 
dark little you. And Z was some zinc, so shiny and bright, which caused you to wink in the sun's merry light. Beautiful zinc.